Hi there and welcome to day five of A Push in One Minute Daily. Today I'll be introducing the native populations of the Northeast, the Mississippi River Valley, and the Atlantic Seaboard while focusing on how they both transformed and adapted to their environment. This region is divided into two major climactic zones with a more temperate climate in the Northeast and a tropical climate in the South and is influenced by the Atlantic Ocean and Gulf of Mexico. Groups in the Northeast, including the Iroquois Confederacy, relied on a combination of agriculture, hunting, fishing, and foraging. They established more permanent settlements, maintained intricate political systems, and were often matrilineal. In the Mississippi River Valley, groups such as the Cherokee thrived through a mix of agricultural practices, including three sisters farming. This refers to the planting of maize, beans, and squash together because they nurture each other like family. Along the Atlantic seaboard groups, including the Powhatan, developed mixed agriculture and hunter-gatherer economies. Coastal tribes were skilled navigators and utilized canoes for trade, fishing, and transportation. The varied climate led to diverse ways of life for groups in this region as they both adapted to and transformed their environment. Join me tomorrow as I talk about the native populations in the Northwest and present-day California in APUSH in One Minute Daily.